So the other day, right, I bought this um, end of line bottle green uh, 2K paint. This sort of green that I've been after for a long time for the old, you know, the original uh, XS650. You had the green tank and the um, gold pinstriping. That's what I wanted to do with the tank on the bike originally, and I finally found this paint. And it's we got like fucking five litres of it here for, for 30 quid, which is alright, only used. You can see the mess I've made down here, <laughs> trying to get it out of the uh, trying to get it out of the tin into the uh, containers. Well I only used probably I don't know a little bit paint in the tank. So I've got tons of this bottle green paint left over to to do other stuff really. Maybe I'll <coughs> I'll give the uh, the other the other XJ tank a paint up and do something with that but anyway let me show you what the tank looks like I actually got the tank off eBay for about 70 quid it was sort of like a painted red red oxide primer but I uh, I completely stripped it completely stripped it down to the metal and, and used some um, grey primer car plan rattle can grey primer on it and the gun I've just used to to actually spray to actually spray the tank is this cheap US Pro US Pro gun didn't really think much of it to start with but after yeah uh, after I've sprayed the tank I'll show you in a second it looks quite good I think <coughs> I'm just about to um, take off the um, the pinstriping so we can see what happens with that so this is the tank after spraying with that US Pro um, gun got a few a couple of blemishes on it really but that's alright because I need to um, one of the blemishes is right where the badge goes so I'm not worried about that don't think that's too bad really I'm not sure when to um, when to take the pinstripes off. It's a bit, it's a bit tacky. So I don't know where to take them off now or a bit later. I think I'll take them off now while it's a little bit tacky. Then they, they won't sort of like peel all the paint up. Hopefully, so give that a go. What are you doing like that? What are you walking around like that for? Huh? What have you seen? Come on, go away from there. We're just going to get cares all over it in a minute. All right, I'll be back. And there it is with the pinstripes taken off, with the uh, masking taken off. So all I've got to do now is wait for that to uh, harden off. I'll give it a, um, a few days two or three days to harden off and then I'll get some um, 1200 grit sandpaper and, and uh, wet and dry and just wet and dry around where the masking was <coughs> to even, even it out a little bit once that's done once that's done then I'll uh, put the badges on Put the two Yamaha badges on, and then give it a couple of coats, a couple of coats of clear coat, and then sand down the second coat, smooth, and then put one final coat of clear coat on, and that should that should do that. 
once I've done all that what I'll do is I'll seal the inside of the tank with a tank sealer put the pet cock on and I'll be ready for the uh, ready for the bike so until then I'll see you in a couple of days <laughs>